Well, hello everyone, and welcome back for another installment of Friday's Favorites. Okay, so let's just do it. I mean, yeah, let's not waste time. Let's not like talk forever, you know, let's get to know each other. So, like we did last time, we're going to pick five, because it doesn't go that long, so I think five is a good amount, and the first one is going to be my favorite book, novel. So, I think that, hmm, I read a lot of biographies and, like, autobiographies and stuff, so, I mean, I would consider that a novel, and I'm going to say it is a novel, it's a chapter book, whatever. I'm going to say that my favorite, uh, I can't even, because I, I, I want to say my favorite biography or autobi. Um, fuck it. My favorite thing to read was Anthony Kiedis' uh, Scar Tissue. It was a CD. Ugh, I used to read it on the bus on the way to work, and by the time I got to work, I'd be, I'd be, I'd be in a mood, like a really odd mood. I feel like I was going through, like, I don't know, something, and then I realized, like, I was going through all these drug problems and withdrawals and situations with this person, and it actually weighed heavily on, like, my emotions after I was done reading it. Um, yeah. Close second, Long Hard Road Out of Hell by Marilyn Manson. Another amazing, amazing chapter book. Whatever, I don't care. Um, the next one is... Ooh, my favorite YouTuber. That's easy. Jeffree Star. I love Jeffree Star. I, I love his makeup tutorials. I love his reviews. I don't wear makeup, but I just think they're fun. I love listening to him. I loved when he did the uh, My Favorites of blank. So it would be like My Favorites of July. My Favorites of 2017. Um, I love him. I love watching his stories. The thing I'm most excited for on YouTube is the Shane Dawson, because he's like my second favorite, and then Graveyard Girl, um, would be Shane Dawson and Jeffree Star's uh, series. They just released one, but they're going to do a three-parter coming out in August. I cannot wait for that. That is going to be amazing. But Jeffree Star, if you ever stumble upon this channel and want me to come and do your makeup for one of your things, like he does like... My boyfriend does my makeup, my boyfriend's dad does my makeup, my boyfriend's trainer A lot of his boyfriend's blanks do. Anyways, I would love to do your makeup. I don't know how, but I'm sure I've, I've watched you. So let's see how well you've trained me. The next one is my favorite piece of art. I so, I mean, if anything... I mean, the thing that really pops out to me is like Jeff Koons' um, giant metal inflatable dog, which I think sold for $42 million, uh, a, a long while ago. That, like, stems out. I mean, also, uh, a, a close second would be, um, The Scream, like, of classic, like, art. MC Escher, I love him, you know, uh, okay, I'm gonna stick with Jeff Koons's thing. He's not my favorite artist, but... That's my favorite piece of art. If I could have any piece of art in my house, it would never fit. I would have to be in a courtyard, but that's what it would be. All right. Um, okay. Fourth one. Your favorite, my favorite actress. I mean, I haven't seen Lady Gaga's A Star is Born. Ugh, I don't know how that's going to go. But my favorite actress, someone that I would constantly watch... I mean, there's someone in my head, um, I got, like, two women in my head, I mean, it's M Melissa McCarthy, she is hilarious, and I love her, but I haven't loved her movie choices lately, I feel like they're kind of going down, but the other one would be, um, I think my favorite actress is Jennifer Lawrence, I love her films, I love her attitude, um, and she needs a gay best friend just like me. I mean, I don't need a gay best friend. I got one. She needs one who's just like me. Like, I should be her gay best friend, Jennifer Lawrence. Again, if you stumble upon this channel, <laughs> I got you, girl. Last one. Last one. Last one. 
My favorite cookie. Okay, well, I love cookies. So I'm going to say that my favorite cookie is not a cookie at all, but it's my favorite, and that is a Pop-Tart. I love Pop-Tarts. I know that's not really a cookie, uh, but it's like a pastry sort of thing. So, it's a, But I guess if you, we were going to get down to the nitty-gritty brass tacks of it all, my favorite cookie are Double Stuffed Oreos. I love them. They're great. I love Double Stuffed Oreos. Or... Again, this one time I was in Amsterdam, and Ryan and I went to this shop, and they had, like, all these cookies and pastries, whatever, and they had, like, mountains of these, um, uh, he makes them for me all the time. They're, like, a meringue cookie that is, uh, spun, like, mixed in with, um, Ground nuts. Jesus Christ. So it's a meringue cookie with ground nuts. They just mix it in and then they bake it. It makes like this pillowy delicious. Anyways, Ryan and I were in Amsterdam and there was a sign on a mountain of them and it said, please ask for assistance. I pointed out the sign. He did not choose to listen and he grabbed one, right? Put it in a bag and we walked on. The women behind the counter got so mad at us. We, we, have, there's a sign there. It says that you cannot take a blah, 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 blah. I mean, probably the reason why is because people have taken it off and the mountain has crumbled. Looking back, that would be a horrific situation. But we're tourists, we're in Amsterdam, so we're not thinking the most clearly. And, yeah, so we almost got into a lot of trouble. I mean, if the mountain fell, my boyfriend and I would have done the right thing. We would have turned around and ran out of that store, ran as fast in the opposite direction, and we would have just never gone back there. It's not the proudest moment, but everything was fine. We ended up sweet talking our way out of a bad situation when we got up there. I can talk myself out of anything. So, I mean, it was fine. We got up there, we charmed the pants off these ladies, and it was fine. Ugh, it was fine. Moral of the story. Pay attention to handwritten signs. Thank you so much for watching another installment of Friday's Favorites. I hope you're enjoying these because um, they're going to keep coming. <laughs> I love telling you that. Bye, guys. Have a great day.